Hey, can you see? So how it is? How it feels? <laughs> I couldn't do this before. Woo! Yeah? Praise Jesus! <laughs> I'm serious. Praise what Jesus! Just, what just happened? I just got healed. Hey, we want to share what God is doing. It's so, so beautiful. When Jesus said the harvest is ready, but the workers are few, he really meant it. The harvest out there is so ready, but we need to go out. In the training school we have here, we are sending people out the last days on a look 10 trip where we have different teams you can see here who are going different places and we want to share some of the testimony that happened yesterday just yesterday four five six with eight people with those people yeah. we all went got baptized people got healed people got set free people went out without a place to stay and god provided a hotel for people god provided the food and it's so beautiful so we want to share some testimony so come here so some of the teams what happened yesterday well, we had all these teams go out yesterday and uh, some crazy things been happening. So we had testimonies come in all day. One of the big testimonies, uh, this team right here, both Paul and Charlie, they went out yesterday, found a lady at a bus stop and they, she had a radical healing done on her knee. So they have a whole video posted. It was amazing. And I have a video that. and that video I will share here. Yeah. Yeah. It's working? Yeah. Hey, can you see? So how it is? How it feels? <laughs> I couldn't do this before. Woo! Yeah. Praise Jesus! I'm serious. Praise what Jesus! Just, what just happened? I just got healed. <laughs> oh my God! Yes, praise <laughs> Jesus! Thank you. Oh. 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 oh, thank you, Lord. Thank oh. you. Oh no! Not I've been us. going to doctors Not for us. years about my knee. Oh my uh -huh. God! All yeah. they want to do is put praise you on medicine, Lord. and I didn't want all that medicine, so I just lived in pain every we want day. Freedom! Praise the Lord! Yeah. Oh my Lord! I'm ready to go for a walk now. Oh. <laughs> Oh it's God. off for the first time in three months. I'm not wearing a knee brace. Wow. And I can walk with and, no pain. And, walk, you, no and you needed a surgery? Yeah. And they want to put me on heavy painkillers. Mm. As a matter of fact, I was talking to my doctor when I came around that corner. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. Praise the Lord. Oh, I wow. was. They yeah. were trying to get me to come in and see him today. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> God is working, I'm glad but Jesus I, I is told king. you, we really want to share the gospel, so we have to arrange somehow, we keep it posted. And then we have these guys here, they went out yesterday on a place to stay, and they actually got two nights at a hotel, paid for, and the amount of money that added up throughout the day from people giving them, and it ended up being $165 to pay for food and everything else. So, and this is the thing we, Jesus say in Luke 10, when we go out, he said, don't take any purse and extra bag and knapsack with you because God will take care of our needs. And many of the students had gone out like that. And also that team, their victory team, God opened the door and they also end up sleeping at a hotel. They prayed for somebody who received the Holy Spirit and they met God and they opened the door and, and then they slept at a hotel. What more? We got people out there, yeah. even though some people didn't get a room last night, but they have set up meetings today for baptisms and also for dinners that are already set from yesterday for tonight. So we hope that these people that didn't get a room last night will be staying at a room tonight and will be baptizing people in water with the Holy Spirit. So yes, God is moving out there. And, and it, I know for many people, me, it seems crazy to go out without everything is planned and organized. But it is plain and organized, yeah. just not by us, right. by, by God. Jesus is going in front. He's preparing the house. And, and, and we, I was, myself, I was out yesterday having a house meeting in, in a place where in Boone, there was like almost 40 people. It was so crowded. And, uh, and, and so many things happened. We had people got baptized. I can show a video here of a guy who got baptized. He had been longing for the Holy Spirit for six years. Mm -hmm. And yesterday, the Holy Spirit came so powerful over him. We have a house meeting tonight. Look around, all of those people. People are getting set free and received the Holy Spirit. See, those got set free. was beautiful. And he, look at him, he just received the Holy Spirit. It's so beautiful. This is what we are called to do all over. We appreciate about out of Jesus' word in Luke that the Spirit is upon him to set the captives free, to give sight to those who are blind, liberty for those who are oppressed. 
and proclaim the good news of the Lord, and this is what he's doing today. So, so we, we, we see this. Look at this face here. Best How that's, is the, it? that's the best man in my wedding. My best friend for eight years. How is it to see this? I, I'm, I'm worshiping God. I was crying, and then Torben gave me the camera. <laughs> How was it? Yeah, I, I just, how was it? <laughs> Beautiful! <Yeah. laughs> it's how I imagined it would be for me, actually. And it I was just wanted to explode. You so. exploded! Yeah. How was it? Uh, uh, we love it. And we, we share the gospel to people. I took a girl up at one time in front of everyone, see God set free. And it was so beautiful. I talked about the freedom in Christ. And she got baptized in the basement with five other people, or four other people who got baptized yesterday. And we had an amazing time. Hey, we're standing here in the kitchen, and the day, the evening is soon over, but a new beginning. How was this day for you? <laughs> it was pretty amazing. You, we, I took her up in the beginning. She experienced of freedom, she experienced healing. You have experienced baptism. Uh -huh. A new beginning, how is it? It's fresh and it's light. And here's yeah. Yeah. Come on! And this is what we can do in the kitchen. I love it. God bless you. A new beginning. <laughs> at the same time, we had the house meet. At the same time, all the teams was all over the place. We had the prayer team, the headquarter team. So we have the headquarter team come here. Some of the headquarter team. You are home praying yesterday yes. and getting the testimony in. How was that? It was very, um, the way that God worked everything. We would, we would hear the need. They would put the request up and we would, we would go into prayer and we would say, God, you know, you provided and let them walk in that. And then, you know, within, within an hour, we would see God move right. in amazing ways. Yes. It was such a beautiful thing to was... see God work. And at the end of the day, when we came down to where some had homes, some didn't, you know, God really gave me a revelation. He said, I provide, mm. but it's not the way you see mm. because we see in the natural, but right. he provides in ways that we can grow. Mm. Each of us are growing. Even here, we're mm. growing and mm. learning about how that God works. That was a works. huge lesson for me. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. Yeah. So this is the headquarters team. So we have people who are going different places. They're sending in, uh, testimonies back. They're sending prayer requests back. The prayer team are praying. We are keeping up with it. Mm -hmm. Why not do this? Like, this is how every church should think. We should think strategic. How to obey Christ? How do we send people out in teams? And then get the testimonies. And yesterday, so many things happened. And today is a new day. Right. And tomorrow I'm going to do right. a new video where I'll tell about what have happened this day. And then we put it all together in a few days. God bless you. Come and join the school next time. If you want to experience this adventure, come and join the school. We are starting in March, the next school. You can sign up today. And I put a link in here. God bless you. Bye-bye.